Today we're talking about this guy, Beamish. The US government tried hiding the horrible things they did to him, but we sued and got his record. Here's what they didn't want you to know. In 2005, Beamish was born at a notorious monkey breeding facility in South Carolina. When he was just two years old, he was shipped to a government laboratory at the National Institutes of Health to be infected with viruses. When he was five, he was sent to Elizabeth Murray's NIH lab, where she cut into his skull and suctioned out parts of his brain, then injected him with toxins and scared him with realistic looking spiders and snakes. All of this was funded by US taxpayers. For the last 14 years, Beamish has lived in a small cage, mostly all alone. His hair is falling out, he's suffering from skin conditions and diarrhea, and he circles endlessly inside his small cage day after day. It's clear he's in mental and physical anguish. Today, at 18 years old, Beamish is still alone in a cage. This must change. Urge the NIH to shut down Murray's lab and send Beamish and the other monkeys in prison there to sanctuaries.